Living next to your job may not sound like a dream come true, but what if this was the best way to find affordable housing? Yeah, that's the new approach from a biotech company in La Vista, which built its own apartment complex. And as KETV News Watch 7's Jessica Perez reports, some employees have already moved into the nest. Jessica. The CEO said she built the nest to help employees handle the expenses that they face. She also hopes the complex will help with the company's recruitment. Employees living at the complex say it's going to make a big impact on their finances. Heidi Mons started working at Streck in June after being a homemaker for several years. As a newly divorced single mom, she found it hard to find affordable housing. I couldn't afford my mortgage anymore. Drex CEO Connie Ryan says she began to notice factors like housing and transportation were impacting her employees. I think the first thing was that it became really clear that we were going to have a shortage of hourly employees. So she wanted to build an affordable housing complex. Yeah, it feels spacious. To help employees like Monts. Being here and feeling like we care about them, I think really makes a difference. So the nest was built. Employees get a housing discount based off salary. New resident David Zaboya says living at the nest also helps him save on gas since his job is literally in his backyard. I'm saving a lot. I mean, I don't think I've, my noodles moved in the last two weeks since I've been here. Ryan says apartments could still look nice if they're affordable. These have new appliances, cabinets and flooring that match. Mont says her apartment has everything she needs and doesn't force her to spend every dime she has. I can save money at the end of the month. Um, not everything is spent on utilities or upkeep, upkeep of a home. Ryan says she thinks this housing model will be attractive to a lot of people, and she sees it helping with recruiting efforts in the future. I think that we will be attractive to a lot of people that are in the hourly price range that are struggling trying to find any type of affordable housing. Ryan says employees who leave Streck and live at the complex would be allowed to stay until the end of their lease, then need to find another place to live. Jessica Perez, KTV Newswatch 7.